You get this error which says couldn't load mods library from disk in Axe Survivor Ascended dedicated server. Then in this tutorial, I will guide you on how to resolve this issue. So make sure to follow these instructions very carefully. Now, this is a very common issue when starting servers. You can ignore it if your servers and mods start up and work fine. But if you're still facing issues, you can try this. Here's how to fix this problem. And a lot of people are able to resolve it by doing this. Open the mod list at the Arc Survivor Ascended and accept the mod general terms and condition. After you accept that, you should be able to join the server and you should install the mods. So open the mod list at the Arc Survivor Ascended and accept the mod general terms and condition. After you accept that, you should be able to join the server and you should install the mods. Now here's how to accept the mod terms and condition. Launch Arc Survivor Ascended and go to the main menu. Click on mods, usually located at the bottom of the screen. If it's, if it's your first time accessing the mods, a pop-up will appear with the mod terms and condition. Read through the terms or scroll to the bottom if you just want to proceed. Click accept or agree to confirm. If you don't see the prompt or accidentally skipped it, try restarting the game. Go back into the mods section, it should now reappear. Once accepted, you can browse, download and activate mods from the mod browser. Until you accept the terms and condition, this should work. Arc Survivor Ascended blocks all mod related downloads silently, which prevents your server and your game from syncing the mods, causing couldn't load mods library from the disk error. So you must accept the general terms and condition. If you don't, if you don't do so, Arc Survivor Ascended will block all mod related downloads silently, which prevents your server and your game from syncing the mods, causing the couldn't load mods library from the disk error. So this is how to fix this issue. Let me know in the comment section if this tutorial has helped you. Thank you so much for watching this video and see you next time.